Okay guys, welcome back to another video. Hopefully you understand what is this. Well, not a real life video. We're not feeling like one of those videos like filling my entire house with like poor people. We're not doing one of those videos. We are actually doing, we are actually doing one of the strongest stories. Not strongest, but extreme. So what is a tornado? And what causes a tornado to be formed? First let's learn about the title of this video, which is called What Causes a Tornado to be Formed. First, what causes it to be formed? Well, super, super, super sounds like super duper, but What's a thunderstorm? If you said thunderstorm, you're correct. Yeah. But, yeah. There's currently one happening somewhere in the world. There could be, or there could be not. But, what happens then? The, the strongest storm is the supercell thunderstorm. Which is three thunderstorms combined to make it. But, how does this supercell thunderstorm literally be could cause a tornado will literally like lightning come down and like winds like pull the clouds and gun down no but simply it's better warm air and cold air mixed together forming a loop will cause the warmer or i think it was the cold air actually the warmer Think it was, to cause it go into the air, but it forms a loop. If you didn't ask, that loop actually goes on the top of the tornado. For the tornado, once it does, it has to be the cold air and the warm air have to be coming from the same, from a different direction. <coughs> from the warm air, from the cold air has to be coming. The opposite direction that the warm air is coming from, and the warm air has to come the opposite direction that the cold air is coming from. A lot of, lot of tornadoes happen in a tornado alley. They even happen here in the in Mexico and the U.S. Cold air comes from the U.S. While well, Mexico completes the hot air from the Caribbean Sea. Yeah. And also over here in the Tornado Alley, which is in the USA. The cold air from Canada raising down into the USA, and the warm air from the Gulf of Mexico rising into the thing. Causing a tornado to be happy. Those start those same things that I just talked about are gonna form smaller and smaller loops. Once the wind, once all of those cold air touch the ground, it will eventually come the tornado. But can it, what can a tornado be caused by? Well, you see, you're like, yeah, that's all, but no. We are on to what is a tornado. What is a tornado? It is a strong moving storm that will come at it. But how does it move to another category? Yeah, tornadoes have categories. For some, a tornado on category one. This tornado is on category one. But the bigger the supercell thunderstorm gets, and the stronger the cold air and warm air get, the stronger the tornado category could get. Like, up to two would like be larger than Super Thunder Thunderstorm. It'll be like two times the size. But no. We, yeah. But this is not the ending of tornadoes. Some, some can go like for 30 seconds and some can go for one hour or even a whole day. That's a lot. A 
longest tornado will be possible, but it has to be come to centuries. Let scientists discover and learn to it. See you later. See you later. See you later. See you later. But, but don't leave the video yet. Make sure to subscribe and hit that notification bell so you never miss another video. And also hit that like button. The tweets 1000. Did I do it? Or did I actually do it? That's what I do. Is that good?